Make this money on my mind Man, I hardly sleep cause I know I gotta grind See, I'm going through a struggle, I'm going through a struggle And there's only one way to get through it, that's hustle I don't do it for the car, I don't do it for the clothes I don't do it for the bra, I don't do it for the hoes I don't do it for the ring, I don't do it for the chain I don't do it for the fortune, I don't do it for the fame I just do it for the I just drank a whole bottle. I'm out of there. I'm out of there. Girl. I'm saying I'm tired as hell. I had to literally get up, drive all the way across town to pick up Quadrat. I got Aaron in my ear talking shit, saying that, oh, why I gotta do it? Why am I picking this girl up? But at the same time, like I said, I feel bad. So I picked her up from the gas station, and she wants me to help her find her car. Like, I ain't doing that, man. Pick crazy ass Keisha up, dog, from the fucking club. This bitch woke up at fucking Rich car in on the beach. Don't do me, bro. For real, bro. Like that shit oh. wasn't my fault, bro. I don't know what the fuck happened. She don't even know. She don't know what happened to the fucking car. Don't know where the fuck the car at. Bro, the car is. She don't got the car. Ain't no car, bitch. <laughs> fuck no. you, man. She don't got the car keys. She calling me screaming and shit. The police. But I thought ahead. I was dead, in bro. Jail, dog. Bro, I was crying. Ain't no, ain't no tears, bitch. I was crying. Dog, she, what you was drinking? Bro, what y'all got? Hennessy and Chirac. She was drinking Hennessy. Hennessy and Chirac? No, 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 I ain't mix it, I ain't mix it. But before I, oh, that's why I was drunk, cause before I got that, I had some goose. Dog. That explain it. And I was knocked out. Sunday, I just woke up cause I was hot, dog, and I just looked at my phone. I see eight missed calls from this motherfucker. I caught that, that, that's about right. Thing that's coming in my mind right now as far as continuing some kind of relationship with Quadrat is that you know I wonder how she really get down because if she get down like this all the time then this friendship ain't gonna last too long hold up Trina yeah do you know what happened to my car <laughs> So, so if I was with them, somebody had to get in my car because my car nigga rig is not, you, you can't, you can't just start my car. You got to put like a screwdriver or some shit. Okay, Lord, don't, Lord. But <laughs> my car nigga rig, bro. You gonna lie. I was fucked up, like smashed to smithereens. Like, I don't know where my car at. I don't know if somebody put something on my drink. I don't know if it's because I had white and brown. I don't know what the fuck going on. But I fought with Max. Cause she came through. About to walk her to class. Hey. Call me Sire, smoking on California's fire. I got all my desires. Last year was a very interesting year. I mean, being a bartender, you see a lot, you make a lot of money, and it gives you time to focus on other things you want to do in life. And for me, I started to think on new things I wanted to do as far as building my brand. I'm getting older right now. So I wanna now I wanna be my own boss. I'm actually tired of working for people. Right now I am looking into branding myself. You know, it's a shame that I gotta go to my bitch job to talk to her face to face because I rarely see her. 
So I gotta go to her job, talk to her face to face to beg her to take time off. Cause I wanna do something special for her birthday. Beg her. As usual, Kale pops up to my job. I really want to know what she wants. What's up? How you doing? What you got up there for? Oh, a birthday coming up. Hey, you want to take it? No. Did you talk to me? You don't forget. I bet you forgot. Are you talking about my days off? Hey, I, I talked to him. Supposedly he's supposed to sign off on it. He ain't really say much about it yet, but I'm not going to keep asking him because at the end of the day, I kind of, I really don't want to take my birthday off. Because I want to work, man. You already know what time it is. So what you saying? If I had something special planned for you, and that don't matter. I ain't going to say it don't matter. I'm going to still take it off, but I got I asked them. I don't, I'm just telling you, I don't want to take it off. I want to work. It benefits me as a bartender. But I talked to him. He said, we supposed to talk again. But then I, I'm, I'm, like, I'm like really pissed right now because, you know, I just told him I want to have a party decided to take it off for my birthday. And then he's like, oh, yeah, you know, I heard about your party, whatever, last week. I mean, last year at Coco's, but you knew him. So I'm like, it is true. I'm fairly new. I'm being like two, three months. So he don't feel like I'm going to do that. But you know, I, I believe that you're going to bring people out because people fuck with you in general. And then last time at Coco's, that shit was like a movie. So, but like, we they, really, we really kind of like bumped heads. He like, really like, kind of like shit on me to the point where I got offended. He was like, a party. Oh, you knew. Like, new party. Like, why you want to have a party? Yeah. That's so it's like, my thing was, you know, I was going to just keep the tradition going, like I was going to do it, day shift. I don't want a night shift party. I don't, I don't like people to pay when they come in, you know what I'm saying? So you're doing and day shift. So that's your problem with making him so like, damn, day shift. Because people don't have day shift party. They mostly do mid shift or night. Yeah, but like, he really kind of like shitted on me to the point where well, okay, I'm, I'm kind of like nervous though. You know what, don't take the wrong way, but I'm happy that you're offended because I'm offended that you don't want to take your days off. Oh, you shitting on me, I'm in business. You don't know if I got stuff paid for already. You don't know what I done did. You tell me you don't want to take no days off. But you got like it's just really against you, man. It's just been like this. Yeah, I just man. don't take that's off. That's fucked up. You don't think that's fucked up a little bit? Okay. I think you're trying because I'm new, but it's all good. You got to do it for your motherfucking thing. Bring the city out here. This whole shit will smash. It's a must. And now you got something to prove. But now you already gained your respect at Coco. You did that already. So now you is over here, you are new, you got new clientele, new people, plus your old clientele that's over here for your job. So you got to make a statement, make everything that you can walk to, you know, walk back to whoever in this motherfucking building that you bring. So basically she's stressing me about taking off uh, so she could take me somewhere for my birthday. That was sweet. It was really sweet of her to do that. But at the same time, Kel, no, I hate taking off. I got to make my money. It's my birthday, so I give in. I'll take off for her. Came by. I know, I know. Had time off, so I came by. I like your place. Good. Gotta have yeah, a little pool move. party soon. So, did you have fun at the body the other night, girl? I was, I was gone. You sure was. <laughs> did you miss it? <laughs> Yo, I think I slapped the poor stripper in the face when I had this all this bunch of money on my hand and I went like this. Bang! I went, bang at that! She went, bah! She was like, <laughs> I was turned off. What was going on with you and um, the little stripper girl with the curly hair? With that bandana. <laughs> she was a wild one. No, I didn't just have fun. I'm just having fun. Why? Was it wasn't. You want to remind me of something I, don't, I forgot about then? Probably forgot about everything. <laughs> the Hispanic friend Deja hit me up after the body to ask me where's the little girl Quiet Dread at. I'm like, why the fuck you asking me? I left y'all two bitches together in the parking lot. Come to find out she done lost her car. Nobody don't know where it's at. She don't even know where she's at. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Listen, tell me why the hell Maxine calling me this morning about where well, the girl that she invited to the um event with like where she at with her car at i'm like what girl you
to talk about some of the girl with the dress. So she was like, all over you. Shop, please. Anyway. She was all But you. anyway, I, like I told her when I left the club. I thought you left the club. How did you think I left with her when you walked up to your car and I, I got in my car? You were so fucked up, you don't remember? Remember you and your friend walked with her to her car and oh, I yeah, left y'all yeah, in the parking yeah, lot? That's true, that's so true. So how did you? That's girl, it, it, was, it was a long night. It how was did, a long night, but she was all over you. So I have a show coming up. It's like in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. Some men are gonna come. You have to come. I go to all your events. Mm -hmm. Are you coming? I will try I will to make it. You're I will make, definitely try to make it. I will course. text you with the address, mm -hmm. and then I'll see you. I'll see you. Okay. okay. With a legal bitch, uh, I said with eagle sit. I got no swag. I write ill shit. Smoke weed, I don't pop pills. Basically, I'm trying to get my music out by any means necessary. So I hit my dog trail up. You know, she the party man. And I was like, let's do a party. Yeah. I know you be doing your thing, you feel me? That's why I mess with you, you feel me? Mm -hmm. I'm not too. I'm in a lot of trouble, you know, trying to keep my head above water. Um, you now I've been performing and stuff. I'm still doing my music. Oh, yeah, you still doing that? Yeah. What's going on with that? Well, I just had a show in February, you know. I had some girls with me, promoting with me. They had Quadrat, Tire, you know, Team Quadrat, because that's the, you know, that's the squad I'm pushing for me. Right. For my girls and stuff, Team Quadrat, that's the hashtag, TQD. But um, I was thinking about doing a little party. I know you you had on your parties. You doing a party yeah. Memorial Day, right? Yeah, I got one more on there. 24. 24? May 24, yeah. Yeah. I think I seen a fly. It's all white party, right? Mm hmm Yeah, man. Your last party was dope. I know this one's going to be hot. Yeah, that last one was hot. Yeah. I had to study. You know, I've been in school and stuff. We just had finals. Taking up. Um, taking up business, and after that, I'm trying to venture into EMT paramedics. Yeah, see what I'm on that too. Yeah. Now I got a background, I'm trying to fight that, but you know, you gotta keep trying no matter what. Yeah. I'm thinking about throwing a little party, you feel me? We, we should do something together. All right. A little penthouse party, maybe July. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you know, I got a personal assistant. I, I have a call you, maybe you could set up a meeting or something. That's cool. Whenever you're ready. Uh, I lost home. Long time ago. Decisions. Decisions. Pick the pen up or put the pen down. Let down, got my mood down. How I feel to be you now. In a couple years, you come ask me that, I won't hesitate no. Only answer back, cause I don't know me yeah. New me or the old me, uh -huh. and that's real I'm tryna build up, tryna grow up, but I'm so stuck So young, I get fucked up, and I fuck up real. See, in the anger, be taking over Yeah, super Charlie, do the super Charlie. super Charlie I lost old friends when this music started, music started. Shit bothered me and I let it This lifestyle, should I forget it? Nah, I'm ready, I'm with it New and beginners, look at the move, I don't see myself in it So far, this shit has been going on Perfect. I feel lost, cause I ain't have a silver spoon So when Trina asked me to come out for a few drinks They said she had some good news to tell me I figured, hell, why not? Plastic wear on the table though, yeah Radiator, heat my ghetto home Hit the doctor, no medical Generic pills, just send me home I've been kicked out, flicked off, ran It's been a minute since I seen Max So I decided to invite her out to P.F. Chang So we could drink us some sake Plus I've been dying to give her the tea, so I have something to tell her. But she be pissed off, but I'm not. No, no. Great for all I got. Uh, Dumb being what I'm not. Yeah, I lost home a long time ago. But I'm what's up with this? Like, like, what is he talking about, though? Yeah. Your night is shining, shining. I'm so fucking glad it's somebody. So boy, everything I asked for, I got it. That's yeah. the good thing about it. Yeah. And what's that? 
talking about, you know, having somebody respectful, financially stable, somebody that know how to treat you like a lady. Somebody you ain't gotta teach what to do for you. They already know a good person. So she older? She's 39. She's not older than me, but yeah, I'm saying, but she ain't no baby like how everybody treats like the baby. Well the baby's like she well, you know, yeah, she older and she got her hair like right. she's getting ready to come down and she's working at Wednesday, so she'll be here on Friday and make her I want you to because I believe she's in Oh shit. <laughs> wow. So for those who don't know about last year, yeah, I kind me and EJ kind of met on some crazy circumstances. And to be honest with you, you know, I was kind of, I, I took the liking to her and her cousin. Not too long ago, her cousin confronted her and told her that me and her actually slept together. I got some tea to tell her that I'm pretty sure she waiting to say I told you so about. I heard about an incident. He was doing a video shoot. Shit was crazy. Man, fucking. Like, it was chaos anyway the whole day. Like, it was just so much going on. I'm glad I didn't come. It was just so much shit going on. Like, you know, trying to get everything organized. And then me running from here, trying to get this shot. Running from here to get this shot. And people jumping in front of the camera. Like, so it was all over the place. And then, top it off at the end of the night. This motherfucker goes and tells goes to, um, talk, uh, goes and tell Aaron that um you know they talking about their own little situation about you know how they they family and you know, they love each other you know just to stop all the madness or whatever. At the end of everything, she goes and say, oh you know by the way me and Max did have sex. What? So you gotta be kidding me. I ain't kidding. So I'm like, I already kind of feel something was up because I'm over there, like, you know, kicking the bulb over the hills and shit. And then I'm walking over there to see why they over there so long. And then Aaron just like, like she about to like, oh, yeah, I'm fucked up, honey. Yeah, like I'm like. So when I came home, like, I said, what's up, ready to go? You don't even talk to me right now. So I knew something was up. So when I'm, I'm sitting in there, I'm waiting for them. So I'm telling them like, okay, every time. She either come to me and tell me shit by myself, or she go to Aaron by herself. Right. You know what I'm saying? Aaron never just be us together. So I just I said, well, fuck it. I said, well, I'm here right now. All of us here. Let's talk. So she's like, oh, well, um, you know, yeah, I told her that we had sex. I was like, so did she say, oh, so she said, oh, so you have sex, man? I said, hell, no, we ain't had no sex. Fuck you, Like, come on, I like. And after all this time, regardless of the fact, even if I did have sex, you waited for a whole year. And you got a whole nother fucking girlfriend to come and say that oh, me and Max had sex. Oh, you know what it is? You waited for she waited for her to break up with her ex. Because she wouldn't want to kill the game like that because then she was so busy lying her ex making it seem like oh, yeah, me and oh, Max just like me, I don't like her. It's nothing like that. But then when wait for her to break up with her girlfriend and come and tell her and her cousin that she's so loved, like she said, right? Oh, I love my cousin, da 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 But just tell her oh, me and Max had sex. So what you trying to do? Well, what was the purpose of her telling that after telling Aaron that after so many months have already passed? That's what I like, want to know. Don't she realize by telling Aaron that so late in the game it'll make Aaron question where she coming from? Like, why would it take you months to finally admit to me after you done been in my face? We done had family gatherings together. We done been right. at events together, and you still hugging and kissing on me too. And you gonna turn around and you gonna say me and Max slept together? And why would you still around and why would you in my face being phony and why did you wait until all of these months to tell me what was your motive we get the fear of chang and i'm thinking that i'm gonna give her my dirt but guess what max shit is more juicier than mine can really have a real conversation because if somebody else around is like you do it it's gonna be filthy. Right. It's definitely one on one, just me and you. You need to have this conversation because if you're done with me, let it, let it be done. Why don't you bring it up to you? Because they had no to tell you. I could have had Max when I wanted to have this bullshit. 
Got about tomorrow, you know I'm out of there. I'm out of there. I'm out of there. Today I'm meeting up with my videographer Ali. You know, I met him at school and shit. We about to go over a video that he shot for me. This was actually one of my first singles. Basically, um, we got to start off with obviously the first verse. Okay. So depending on, I don't know how you wanted to come in, but you did one strong take where it was like your whole verse, the first verse. I'll jump. All right, so do it again. All right. So yeah, babe, thank you for that, man. Yeah, you already know. Anytime, I got you. All right, so. Um, you like the video though? It came out straight. Yeah, man. Right. To be honest with you, I love that shit, boy. You feel me? So you really right. do a good job, and I. I appreciate you, my really nigga. No, appreciate your love. So look, I'm doing a party. Her name's Sunshine, you feel me? So, and she's very popular. So by her being popular and me trying to come out with my music, yeah. it was a good idea to promote her as well as my music. Yeah. Oh, wait, but, so that's the same girl right there. Yeah, her name's Sunshine. Yeah, yeah. But the song's not necessarily about her. It's just about, you know, about trying to fall in love with somebody and you're going through a bad situation but they, they lift you up mm. everything look like it's a1 you feel me like i really fuck with him like he doing his thing right now like i trust him you know what i'm saying i'm fucking with it you ain't know nothing about it you wouldn't know don't expect you to know nothing about me you wouldn't know nothing about it Glorymusic.com people don't see you. You ain't no, you ain't no nothing about it. Ain't on the PM, no sleep. Ain't no off days on the week. So today Trina hit me up to have a few cocktails with her and lounge by the pool. So it's a beautiful day, why not? We do a couple of new nights. Oh yeah. Yep, I met somebody new, but I don't know if it's gonna work. Mm -hmm. I ain't with the long. Uh, how far? 8,000 miles away, Afghanistan. You know how it is when you got one of them people that make their money, mm -hmm. and they think it's money, power, and respect. Mm -hmm. I don't give a fuck what I got going on in my life. I don't have no ticket on my head. Right. So at the end of the day, I don't know if it's going to work because that type of person, they used to their money controlling their life. Mm -hmm. With me, I don't care what you got, bitch. If you ain't gonna be there for me and be there how I need you, it's not worth it. I've dealt with 800 miles away and that shit is tough in itself. So, sounds like you and old girl got a lot to talk about. Yeah, bitch, what happened at the photo shoot? You ain't tell me about that. Here. I heard the little birdie came in your ear and tried to tell you some shit that wasn't right. Which photo shoot? Um, the video shoot for the song. What happened to your cousin telling you about this little extra shit that happened? Girl, I don't know. I don't, I don't keep I'm listening. I don't. What happened? To be honest with you, you know, on stage. I don't really know. I don't remember what happened. All I know is she was trying to check me about some shit that happened between her and Max. Do you believe her? Bitch, bye. Okay. You see? That's all that matters. Because I already know my friend ain't about that. It ain't even about that. So did it change our relationship? Absolutely not. And, I'm um, talking about not you and Max, but you and your cousin. Uh, no more than it already was. I mean, it was because you expected that out of her. Of course. So everything good with you and Max now? It's always been good between me and Max. You know y'all a power couple. Don't let nobody come between them. Nobody worry about that. Okay. The thing I is, to, it's hard because that's no, no, a family no, no. member. How is, do you work that the out? The thing is with her, she feels defeated. You know, she's supposed to be 
<laughs> Maybe you know who, bad bitch, or whatever. Mm -hmm. If I'm supposed to be her shadow, her sidekick, her Robin to her Batman, mm -hmm. and it's unfortunately, it's unfortunate, after conversing with her and people conversing with me, and you getting to know who the, the, brain, different parties. Who the brains of the operation, mm -hmm. she gets overshadowed and she can't take She's that. pinky and you're the brain. <laughs> Cocktail, please. <laughs> Commissary ain't free, but I hope you get this one from me. Ooh. You ain't know nothing about it. Brown sun legal. Hoping them people don't see you. You ain't know. You ain't